Me and my vicious pit bulls have rung in the new year. So, so such, vicious. such vicious, such violence I see in this one. <laughs> I am so tired, but it was fun to watch like the, the ball drop. Like we didn't watch any of the commentary that's meant to be really funny and everything, but we saw the ball drops. That was pretty cool. Um, we don't get to see them in Australia because it happens like half a day after the actual new year. So this is fun, yeah. And fun to get a New Year's kiss. Bad management. Bad management is what loses you money, and Astro Burger's curious style of management, let's put it that way, lost them like 20 bucks of our money. Cause we were gonna go there and get breakfast burritos. We've been meaning to for ages. We go there and they're like, oh, we only serve breakfast until 11? It's 11.03 on New Year's Day. No one is going to be awake before 11. It's ridiculous. No one is gonna come in at 11.30 on New Year's Day wanting a cheeseburger. Nobody! So, now we're going to Food Lab, where we hope they will be slightly more reasonable with their, their breakfast all allotted hours. Food Lab is closed completely. Not the start to a good year. On the brighter note, the roads are like hilariously empty. So what happens on LA when there's any like vague holiday or anything, the roads just clear up and nobody leaves the house. We're at Universal Hollywood Studios! Yay! There's the big ball, there's the big old park entrance behind us. But guess what? We're not going in! Yeah. We're just going to a movie. It's a really pretty afternoon. Really nice sunset over there, nice clouds in the sky. We're taking the clickety clackities for a walk. I'm not sure if I ever just uh, described why we call them clickety clackities, but it's because we'll wake up in the morning and make the vaguest little noise and they sleep in the in the lounge room and you'll just hear this click 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 as their claws kind of tap down the oh tabs no 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 hey big girl it's okay tabitha come on yeah you'll just hear this noise coming from the lounge room just click 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 as their claws tap along there's like like the lino it's the funniest noise they don't make any noise themselves it's just their claws clicking and clacking so you always know the dogs have woken up when you just here, click, 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 click. Boomerang Aussie pies are what we had for dinner. They're really delicious. They're like the only meat pies I've been able to find in the stores. There are some really good ones that you can get in like cafes and bakeries and stuff, but the only one I know is in downtown LA. So we have these ones in Whole Foods that we get that are really delicious, really, really good. So another week, another boomerang Aussie pie. <laughs> And asparagus, healthy, healthy asparagus. I can't exactly remember what's in this guy, but it's something to do with salted caramel and lavender and chocolate and shortcake and a dollop of cream, and it looks amazing. We cut it up, so it's kind of hard. It doesn't look as good as it did before, but it, 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 I'm really excited. It, is. it has proper caramel, like good old proper caramel, not like the dodgy stuff you get in most things. 